use the following sets to illustrate that the set difference a minus b equals the intersection of a and b complement. So what we'll do is we'll calculate each side of this separately and show that we get the same answer both ways. To take the set difference, again we start with everything in A, and then remove from that any elements that appear in B, which again are the elements 7, 8, and 9. So we remove those from this set, and that leaves us with the set difference. To find A intersect B complement, we don't directly need to find B complement because the intersection consists of points that are in both of these sets. So all we need to ask ourselves is what belongs to A and does not belong to B? Well, we get the same answer, of course. It's the same reasoning, what's in A but not in B, and that's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. So it makes sense that the set difference is everything in A and not included in B, because of course that's how we find the set difference. So this equality should not be surprising.